Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So I was thinking So anyway, I asked you guys on IG to to suggest what you wanna hear from me and you guys are dirty wa is on any come and kwanza. So I have decided to do like maybe a story time for you guys about the, the most stupid things I've ever done in life. But I have shot this video like five times now, but the first one it became too long. The second one my earring fell off. The third one nika cheka sana nika stop too. So I'm thinking because I've done a lot of stupid things. I'm thinking each stupid thing should have its own video because ni mona ni over seven minutes each. So I don't want you guys to start watching watching long long videos monza complain. So I'll just do one story time. Each story, its own video, require shots, and I'll make it interesting as possible. So, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, kindly please subscribe. And before I get to learn my editing, you'll just bear with me. Okay, so it has to do, it has something to do with a man, of course. These boys are stressing me. These boys are doing me dirty. As in what? Anyway, so as we all know, I don't like cute boys. Napenda watu kuna sura personal in a beauty. Marafikizangu wazisikei wanzo kasirika. So, I met this guy online. Of course, we felt like, you know, me and him were good, like we connected really fast so we were like okay let's meet so we met and you know to couple of friends so to kanza chat nini so he stayed okay at that time i was in nakuru so i'll go ship past nakuru so for him to come to nairobi ni lazima ange ange pita nakuru ndeda nairobi now for him to come from nairobi he had to pass through nakuru to whatever but i'll go and end up so most of the times, Akipita and Nicola and Nemia, hi, Nina Pita Nakuru, come see her, then I talk to her, I go see her. Akitoka to the Nerubi and call, hi, Nina Pita Nakuru, come see her. Like that was the trend. So at this particular day, he told me, yes, and at a, at a talk to her, I came to Nerubi, so I was ready to talk to her. So I said, I'm going to talk to her. But since I'm going to go to call, I'm going to be in the to come. But then he didn't call me, so I was like, oh, maybe I'm going to come back. So I'm going to call. Hey, kidogo, akakuja, aka, akakuja na kapita na kuru bila kuni call. Ati alisa how? How do you say how that your girlfriend stays in a kuru? Unafaa kumpigia simu, ukujo msalimi. Cause it's so abnormal. You have a boyfriend apita kwenye bila kuku call. Kwa baby, do na apita kwenye. Ah, you never get to babes. I can be like, babe, uneza pita kuinu, nini na pita kuinu, come say hi. Then I was, kwa nasema nini. So, anyway, muna get kinye nasema, like, it's so abnormal, like, mtu, uh, uh, boyfriend yako apite kuinu bila kukwambia. So, akapita, then I was like, oh, sasa ukuja na kwa pita. Then I called him, I'm like, oh, Fiki. Then he told me, ah, nime pita. Then I was like, what? The hell? Then I was like, okay, cool. Mama Paliuko, I'm coming to say hi. No, Jay, he's gone like 17 kilometers, like really far. I'm a Peter. Okay, we don't stay. Nakuru town, we stay after. So for me to come from home to Nakuru time, it will take me like, uh, to Nakuru town, it will take me like 30 minutes to get to town. And then from Nakuru town to wherever he was, to that place that he was, it will take me like, I don't know, like over one hour. But I'll go around Nakuru County. I can be so, I go to around Nakuru County. And as mama, I can tell me, I can be as mama, like you're not going anywhere. Like I was so addicted to that boy. I don't even know, like, I get more than I go addicted to him, but I really was addicted to that guy. So I can be as mama, I went to Pahali's mama. And I can be as mama, I can tell you what I can do. And I can be as mama, I can tell you what I can do. Mama, mimi uyo piki piki, ni bebe, ni kapanda piki piki. Why 
ndio maana nakwambia najitanga mkutano na jamia Saviano you see we we serve this is not you and guess what piki piki kutoka hapo nililipa 1500 do you know the distance that you have to go with a motorbike for you to lipa 1500 cuz unajua unaendanga distance kubwa sana unaambiwa ni 50 bomu unashanga 50 Unaenda distance nyingine unaambiwa tu so unashangaa eh hey, umeenda sana sana nokalipa 200 so imagine a distance i have i had to go ndio nilipe 1500 shillings nikakaa juu ya pikipiki so hizo i had shukad some hair like big hair so ina peperuka tu hivi alafu pikipiki inaenda mbio ndio nilikuwa naambia arakisha like you can i have to say hi listen to my boyfriend i feel like every time ikianza kudit mtu nakwanga tuna some weird thing happening na before ni date mtu nasemanga sab This is a chance that you're being given. So concentrate on this relationship. Stop being dramatic. Try be a good girl. Nini nini. Esa hizo nanjambia tu kind. The drama that I'm. As in naonanga ni kasi na drama, but sana kikaa hivi after your relationship na sema what's up bona nilifanyanga hivyo surely. So nimekaa juu ya pikipiki nywele tu ina peperuka tu hivi juu pikipiki inaenda speedy. Eh hey, alafu na jamba ridi kukugonga tu even uko juu ya pikipiki machozi inatoka. So nywele machozi inaenda tu huko nyuma na ikandika nipo. <laughs> machozi inaenda tu huko tu juu ya pikipiki tumeenda. Nywele hata sijui mbona siko askupewa helmet. Tumeenda like hadi nikambie mtu. Hapa imefika ngapi? Ananiambia 500. Kamwambia wa so bado 1000 sasa juu tuko tshaba game nilimwambia uko utafikisha ngapi anambia uko ni 15 uko ni mbali sana tukafika pale nikamwambia no kinis okay vet nilikuwa juu ya pikipiki nikaona eh distance imekuwa mbali ama ni stop tu so either the guy is calling me ananiambia alakisha mimi niko na raka nitachelewa mimi naambia no baby kila lazima nikusalimie eh so naulizo mtu wa pikipiki hapa tumefika how much ananiambia 500 na tumekuja mbali like tumekuja really fast nasikia kumwambia acha tu nipande matatu as in ingekuwa easy nipande matatu inge ni cost 50 bob na get eh by the ingetu cost 50 bob but sasa pikipiki na niambia bado nishakula 500 bado sasa 1000 so imagine what tumeenda tu hivi nywele machozi mimi tu hivi simu boyfriend na niambia harakisha niambia pikipiki twende nakwambia by the time nafika huko goosebumps zimeja tu asi goosebumps as a goosebumps zile vitu za baridi zimeja tu hivi machozi hadi kamechora lion nywele iko hivi napata kijana tana haraka amesimama tu hivi na wasichana kwa gari where are you going mnaenda pia Nairobi to sleep in which hotel with the girls kwa gari na nimetumia 1500 kupanda pikipiki ni kuje ni kuone na uko na wasichana kwa gari you're going to Nakuru to book a hotel na kuka as in ilikuwa tu nijijazie these girls are going with these boys to do this and that cuz you know as in sijawahi kasirika hivyo sasa mtu apikipiki anakaa hapo nimlipe na Mpesa nimefuliza ah. as in nilienda tu home nikashangaa nimetumia 1500 kupanda pikipiki na ningetumia tu 50 bob ni venye tu mata inge ni atakisha inge ingeshinda ik stop stop wa i just said hi actually tulienda hapo tumeko sana tu hapo cuz i said hi then nipana kuna sana kwa gari nikaboeka nikamwambia okay poa bye pikipiki tena you know what Boys, I gotta go. I gotta leave.